What's up? It's me again. With another video. Um. Anyway. Some of, some of the, the most beautiful women in the world. Had even influenced cross-dressers. That's right. Had influenced cross-dressers. Um. Jackie Kennedy Onassis, uh, Grace Kelly, uh, Marilyn Monroe, Princess Diana, and the list keeps on going. And anyway, to be influenced by someone that you admired in history, always you have to have some kind of of way um, where you can be influenced and some people have been influenced by others and others yeah follow in the footsteps of just one person and anyway for for me for for example as a cross dresser growing up in the, in uh, the late seventies, um, my influences has always been my grandma Barbara Damon, um, Grace Kelly, and Marilyn Monroe and Jackie Kennedy Onassis. Of uh, those four, had have really placed a major influence on me when I was growing up in uh, the late 70s, the uh, the early 80s, and right up to now since since I live in Florida. And um, who can tell on who would be the next woman to influence you, the cross-dresser? That's right, you, the cross-dresser out there. So, um, follow, fo <clears throat> if you want to follow in my example, you're welcome to. And basically, I'm alright with that, to tell you the truth. And, um, it goes with me no matter what, no matter what it is. And you can be influenced even by by sporting figures like um, Roger Maris, Mickey Mouse, uh, Hank Aaron, Babe Ruth, Joe DiMaggio, any of those greats. But when when it comes to cross dressing, you have to be influenced by the woman that you admire. And that is what is in, well, that is what is important to you and to you alone. Nobody else, you know. So, um, anyway, <coughs> I would like 